back to The Sims 4 season. So it has been a minute since I have filmed any Sims 4. I apologize, but we are back. And here is Mr. Dallas and his little, his little makeover. He is so freaking cute. He's a little bit hungry this morning and I think everybody is just going to be getting ready for school and for work. We're going to let you get some leftovers. Did you do your homework? Okay, you did your homework. You did yours. You did yours. Awesome. The kiddos are pretty much set to go. Why don't we have you go ahead and take a speedy shower and Liam how are you doing you go to work today you do so we're gonna have to go to work with him today he is a level four detective he needs to solve one case and she works in 41 minutes successfully promote cause hold on what does that mean how do we do that how do we promote a cause you have to like go on the computer or something Oh my gosh, it's been a hot minute since I have even done this. So political career, check, check cause progress. We're going to do that, I guess. Uh, yeah, I guess that's what we're going to do. Can you maybe clean the litter box? I know you're going to do other things, but we're going to have you clean the litter box instead. And how are you doing, Zoe? Zoe needs some food in her life. So why don't you come over here and eat? And then I think everybody will be doing pretty good. I do want to get Juniper to go over and see Ollie because so far, Ollie, I don't think he believes the thing that we're saying. I don't think he trusts us at all. I think he genuinely thinks that Juniper is going to do, you know, what he doesn't want her to do. That she's going to fall back onto the bad things and, you know... She's just gonna, she's gonna prove she's not gonna give up that, you know, she's not gonna give up at all about trying to prove to him that she wants her daughter back, she wants him back, she wants, you know, a good life again, so hopefully he will be able to see that. So he works in one hour, I think everybody else is probably gonna be heading off to work in school, so, okay, looks like we are. So... What do we need Juniper to work on today? Let's take a look. She is doing great. So we're just going to have her make friends. And Cyrus, you are going to also go ahead and make some friends. And Dallas, since it's your first day, we're going to have you just do some normal work. And you, um, we're just going to go ahead and let you do you. You're going to do you, hunty. Okay, okay. Are you going to, like, get rid of all this stuff? You good? Because I was going to say, this is this is getting to be a bit of a mess here. So, at least we got rid of that. Uh, can you come over here maybe bond the bees and sell the honey? Even though we're probably going to get stung because I don't think we've really, uh, you know, done too much with them in a hot minute. And they're irritated. Oh, okay. So, I think it's okay. Maybe the bees like him. I don't really... Oh, oh. Oh, I was wrong. Oh, I was wrong. I thought I thought everything was going good. I thought we were going good. All right, so we're going to go join him on his day of work. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry, Liam. I didn't mean to get your butt stung, but I thought it was going to work out okay. <laughs> All right, so what we need to do is solve a case. So we're going to have to figure out how, uh, how to solve a case today. It's been a minute since I've play the detective career. I really want to get some jobs back into this game, but it just, I don't think anybody's updated them, but it's been a while since I checked. Uh, it's time to start fighting crime. First things first, use a computer to get a case assignment. Okay, so let's go and do that. Can we kick somebody off the computer? Like maybe you? Let's go over here and get a case assignment. And it's storming. There's a thunderstorm. Ugh. Oh my gosh, look it out here, you guys. It's it's pouring down. We need to make sure we don't get our butt um, struck by lightning because, you know, that would kind of suck. <laughs> that wouldn't be very good. All right, are you going to get yourself a case assignment or are we just going to stand here and stay with the purple girl? Okay, like, can we just seriously, she's got purple skin, it's fine. You act like you've never seen it before. <laughs> Goodness. All right, so Cyrus has met Isabella. Oh, she looks like she's a cutie patootie. All right, assist with crime scene investigation. You will learn the ropes before you can handle running your own case. You'll start by assisting a veteran detective with a crime scene investigation. Investigation. Use the crime map to travel to the crime scene. All right. Well, I guess that's what we're going to do since that's what we have to do. So let's go ahead and travel to the crime scene. 
I kind of like these, uh, I wish there were more jobs like this that you can go to work with them. I don't know. I just think it's so much more fun when you're actually able to do the job, you know? I don't know, because it's just, it's just exciting to me. So, I like being able to do the job. All right, crime scene. At the crime scene, you can find clues that will help you track down a suspect, investigate damaged or stolen objects, and search for clues on the ground nearby to uncover more evidence. Also, talk with witnesses to get reports about what has happened. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, here's here's the co-worker. Um, is there anything around here that we can uh, possibly... Hmm? Oh, there's something over here. Search for clues. Yeah, let's search. Ooh, what is this? <gasps> Collect evidence sample and take picture. Ooh, and this as well. I love how my co-worker is over here not doing any work. Jasper Jenkins. Thanks a lot. <laughs> You're not helping me at all. Like, at all. You're just over here being a dang loser, but whatever. Ooh, it looks like there's something over here. Collect evidence sample. Take evidence picture. We're going to just get all of the things that we can possibly get. And you know what? We're going to go ahead and search for clues here as well. Where are they? There we go. Oh, she's in the damn way. Of course she is. Of course you're in the way. Girl, you want to act like you're doing something? Get out of here. Get out of here, all right? And then we're going to also search for clues here. He's like, see, I can do it too. Is she the alien? Oh my god, she is. I didn't even realize she was an alien. I thought she just had purple skin. Because <laughs> I got different skins in my game, so don't judge me. All right. All righty, so we're taking some more photos. We need to do a couple of witness reports. So, oh, another alien. Take a witness report, please. And thank you. I think we got all the evidence we needed in here. Uh, is there any more? Ooh, there might be something over here. So we'll have to search for clues over there. And it looks like over here, too. Oh, my goodness. Ugh. I just filmed the Sims 4 Let's Play, and I thought my cold was getting better, but I still sound a little bit, like, raspy. So I apologize if I sound a little weird. Which is not any different from any other day of my life, but I'm a bit stuffy, so it's annoying. I hate when people go to work and they're sick. Like, if you're sick, don't go to work, okay? Like, just don't, because that's why I'm sick right now. Ooh, there's a couple things here. Let's go ahead and collect evidence sample. Collect evidence sample. And then we'll also do the same here. Alright, let's see if we're missing anything. All right, so it looks like we're doing pretty good. I don't see any more little spots on the ground, um, but I think we can just search anyways. So, oh, it looks like we must have gotten everything because we have to return to the police station, but I'm going to go ahead and let them search, search in here just, just for the heck of it. Can we get her report? Yeah, let's take a witness report from her because we haven't taken one from her. Is that the only Sims that we need to take a report from? I think so. So we're going to have him take a report from her, and then we're going to head back to the office, I guess, or the police station. Jasper, you know, we're here first. You sit here acting like you're flirting with her. Like, can you not? Samantha didn't provide much, but maybe we'll fit into the case somewhere. Well, that's just great. Thanks a lot, Samantha. All right, we're going to go ahead and return to the police station. Oh, wait, is that? Hold on, he's taking pictures of something. Is this? Oh, I didn't even notice this. Okay, let's do that, too. Even though we have all of our evidence samples, but I didn't even notice that uh, the computer was, like, a mess. So, all right, now we're going to return to the police station. I think we have gathered pretty much everything. We got a lot of stuff, at least. So, that's pretty exciting. See if we can finally solve a case or get close enough to that to do so. We're probably going to have to do some investigation on the things that we found, I would assume. Oh, I wish I could breathe, you guys. Like, it's really sucky when you can't breathe and you're trying to, like, talk and stuff. Like, you just can't breathe out of your nose. That makes no sense, but it does to me. Uh, now that you gathered evidence from the crime scene, it's time to start tracking down a suspect. Use a chemical analyzer and computer to evaluate the evidence you found at the crime scene. There's a chance you'll discover some information about who committed the crime. Ooh, okay. All right, let's go over here and analyze some of our evidence. Let's see. Oh. Okay, of course. Of course you want to come over here now that I'm using it. There's two other ones and you want to use the one that I was going for. Whatever. Whatever. Alright, let's see if we can 
figure out something about the person who has done whatever crime it is that they did, but looks like they burnt a couple things. Like, were you trying to, were you trying to do some arson or something? Like, I'm just wondering. Just wondering here. All right, Juniper has met Parker while at school. Ooh, she looks cute. All right, what do we got going on here? Did we find anything? You look like you don't know what you're doing. And I was right. It failed to produce any useful information because he's just freaking tapping along on the keyboard as if he knows what he's doing, but he doesn't have a damn clue what he's doing. Oh, man, what are we going to do here? What are we going to do? Look at him. There he goes again, just tapping away, acting like he knows something, but he doesn't know anything. Do you know what you're doing? You're a little bit too close to the screen. She's doing the same thing. So he's just copying her because he's like, well, she looks like she knows what she's doing. And she's kind of got like a, a scientist coat. Oh, but she's slapping ahead. So she doesn't know what the hell she's doing either. All right. So it looks like we produced a useful clue. Uh, nice work. Analyzing evidence from the crime scene allows you to discover clues about the suspect. Once you're running your own case, you'll, you'll, you'll have to analyze lots of evidence before you can find the suspect. For now, use a computer to file a crime scene evidence and the senior director or detective can take over. Well, dang, I wanted to solve the case, but no, we got to let somebody else do it. Okay, whatever. Let's come over here and file crime scene evidence since, you know, we can't go and do it ourselves. Get the hell up. Prince Voss, get up. Get up. Get up. Give me the computer right now. Get up. With the creepy stash, get out of here. Man, if you don't get your ass over here, I swear I'm going to lose it. I'm going to lose it. Okay, sit down. Oh, my sins, I'm telling you. They stress me out, you guys. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay, good work. The evidence you found will be helpful to the detective in charge. Well, I wanted to solve it, but whatever. We, we're, we're good enough. We could do it. Want to get your own case? You'll have to follow up on the evidence yourself. Tomorrow you'll learn the next steps in the case. Who now takes some time to help process criminals here at the station? Okie dokie, if that's what you want me to do. All right, so we have to get some fingerprints and search some criminals. Let's do this. Let's do this. Let's go ahead and fingerprint. Um, ooh, you look pretty. Let's go fingerprint you. <laughs> you look pretty. Let's fingerprint the pretty girl. Okay, I'm losing my damn mind. We're losing it. We're losing it. I haven't filmed for a few days and I'm losing it. All right, let's do this. Get out the way. Get out the way, Miss Alien. Allison. Ooh. She cussing them out? Girl, you need to calm down. You really should. All right, this is a bit of an awkward situation. Uh, yeah, this is really awkward. Okay. Okay. So, do you guys watch Orange is the New Black? Because for a second, she looked like, uh, so-so. Um, yeah. Just for a second there. Anyways, let's go ahead and fingerprint her. And then we're gonna also go ahead and search her. And take your mugshot since we have to do all of that stuff. Oh, promoted to campaign intern. Veronica has been promoted. She will now make an additional 10 simoleons an hour. Uh, she's also received the following bonus, 172 simoleons and debate politics interaction. So she works 8 a.m. to 3 p.m. Alrighty. So it looks like everybody's doing pretty dang good. Interesting. You better watch where you're putting your hands. She, she, she might be into it because right now this is a little bit awkward. Like, what, 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 what is happening? What is happening? Okay, okay. What the hell? What do you got that in your, what do you got that in your pocket for? Don't shake your head. Okay, this is very, very interesting how they just kind of freeze up there and it's like kind of freaking me out just a little bit. It's freaking me out just a tad bit. All right, we're going to take her mug shot. Let, let's see. Look at her. She's ready. She's ready for this. She's waited all day for this mug shot. Are you going to take, take the damn mug shot? She's standing right there. Just take it. Where do you get that? Since when are you allowed phones in jail? Like, since when? Since freaking when? Never. Since never. Liam, you know... <coughs> oh my gosh, I'm sorry, you guys. You just, you're stressing me out, Liam. If you just do what I told you, we would be in a much better place right now. All right. Now let's go lock her up back in the... Can we do that? Can we lock her back up? Lock and sell? Noel, Noel, Noel. It says to take a police report from a civilian, but we don't have any civilians, so we can't do that. But it is pouring down rain, so we need to take a, another book shot. Book shot. <laughs> oh my God! 
What is wrong with me? Okay, let's go over here and take another mug shot, not a boob shot, <laughs> of Masami Sakamoto. Yeah, I probably said that so wrong, but we're gonna hurry up. Liam, you're taking so long that you're gonna ruin everything. Like, you really are stressing me out. Who are you? A detective, okay? And we are just what? What are we? It doesn't even say what we are. What? What is our title? Oh, we're a detective as well. But you have fancier clothes than us, so you must be the lead detective is all I can say. All right, let's go take your mug shot. There we go. And then we're also going to search her. Hopefully we are going to be able to do this before time runs out, but Liam's taken a heck of a long time in, to do anything here for some reason. Liam, you're just, you're just, you're killing me, Smalls. Let's do this. Like, my goodness. I want to get your job performance up, but you're, you're taking forever to do anything. Okay, what? Why the hell you got a microphone? What are you, what are you doing with that microphone? Do I want to know? Probably not. Okay. Like, that's just too weird for me. Do we, do we get this? Awesome. Now let's go lock her in her cell. It is storming so hard outside. You see that? It's like shaking the building, you guys. Look at this. It's freaking pouring down rain. Do we have anything happening anytime soon? Okay, end of shift. He got 609 smiles. Well, I will never know because we're going back home. But we're going to see if we can go visit Ollie. I was going to invite him over, but it seems like when we invite him over, he kind of just like disappears and stuff. So we're going to go to him and visit our daughter because we miss her so freaking much. I miss Belle. I miss her so much. But we need to convince him that we are okay enough to take care of her. So let's make sure the kiddos do their homework. Breeze do your homework. Do your homework. And Juniper, no one's on honey. Okay, go ahead and do your homework. And then we're going to go visit Mr. Ollie and kind of see, see how things are going. So, all right, homework complete, homework complete. Who is calling you? Probably, I was going to say, I can almost bet you it was going to be Zan. And it is. And we you know what? We've been kind of ignoring him. So maybe we should invite him over soon. Because uh, he is trying to be in their life, even though he's not the best. But, you know, we should probably, you know, at least acknowledge him somewhat. All right. How's our plants doing? We're not going to go outside and mess with our plants right now because it is storming like crazy and I don't want her to, you know, die or anything. So we're going to go ahead and travel and we're just going to go to Ollie's house, which I can't remember where the heck it is. It is in Oasis Springs, I'm pretty sure. It's in here. Is he home? Okay, oh, they're both home. Let's go see them. I'm so excited because it's been forever. Okay, maybe we can kind of, kind of talk in, talk them into being friends. I don't know. Oh, there he is right there. He is right freaking there. Let's go knock on door because I want to be able to go inside and see. Oh, he's taking a selfie. Okay. What is this little wish? Uh, to ask Ollie to be boyfriend. Okay, where? Oh, there she is. Look at our little grown baby. <gasps> Let's come over here and ask her how she's doing in school. Um, and what else can we do? We're going to ask her how her day is. Oh, our baby is so grown and I can't even deal. Uh, let's lecture her about misbehavior because if she's misbehaving, we need to make sure that we, uh, we make sure that that's not happening, you know? We want to make sure she's doing good. We're going to discuss her interests. We're just going to kind of chat it up with her and see how school's going, how her life is going, you know? Just all of that fun stuff. Ollie, where are you? Oh, you're just chilling outside. We need to come back over here to Ollie and maybe, um, what could we do? Let's have a deep conversation. She's going to sit down with him and pretty much lay it all out and be like, listen, my school grades are good. I'm done doing drugs. I, I'm i doing a lot of positive things. Uh, gardening has become something very important to me. You know, she's going to tell him all these positive things and he's like telling her about Belle and everything. So maybe he will kind of see what is going on. Uh, let's... Let's kind of, let's go ask him to cloud gaze. 
let's do that. We can kind of spend some time together and, you know, just kind of talk about what's been going on. And hopefully he will, he will, you know, kind of see that. He is inspired right now. So maybe we can get a little romantic and butter him up and see if we can embrace him. We'll see if that'll work. I don't know if it'll work, but we're going to try to embrace him and see if we can get things to work out the way that we would like them to. Uh, looks like Belle's probably going to go watch some TV. Hopefully she did her homework. Uh, can we tell her to do her homework? Oh, she is very excited about something. Uh, can we tell her to do her homework? Encourage recent, be recent behavior. Ooh, yes, let's do that. We definitely want her to do dishes and we want her to, like, you know, do good things. All right, go ahead and get up. We're going to see if this embracing is going to work or if he's not going to be feeling it. Because, like... Oh, okay. He is actually feeling that. Okay. Okay. So that's pretty exciting. Um, maybe we will flirt with him a little bit and see where we can see where we can go with this. Um, maybe we'll see if we can get a little kiss in there. Possibly. He seems to. Oh, oh, guys. He's he's taking it. He's into it. Maybe, maybe he's finally. Uh, Kind of seeing that she might be, she might be, uh, on the right track here. All right. Okay. Is she reading? No. Okay. Oh my goodness. Girl, you need, you need to not, be, you cannot be cursing around your daughter like that. Okay. <laughs> oh my gosh. Let's see if we can maybe get him to be our boyfriend in this part. I mean, that's what she wants. So let's go ahead and see if we can knock that out. Uh, let's see. Do a pickup line. Another kiss. Let's see if we can get this. Let's see if we can get this where we want it to be. Because right now he seems like he he is all about it. Like he seems to be very very about this. Ooh, we can ask him. Let's do it. Let's do it. Is he gonna Is he gonna say yeah? Oh, <gasps> you guys! Yay! She is going to be so excited now. Oh, my goodness. So, oh, now she's cussing. Okay, girl, you need to not do that. You need to not be like that. Okay, let's be enticing. Uh, let's give him a passionate kiss. Oh, we'll kiss his hands. So maybe they can actually be a family. Maybe we could get... I don't know if he would be able to move in. I was going to say maybe we can get him and uh, Belle to move in kind of work on his schooling and work on her schooling and make sure that they kind of, you know, I, I think that uh, Veronica and Liam would take them both in as long as it meant that, you know, things were going good. I think that Veronica and Liam would take them in and make sure that, you know, their well-being is good because he's off on his own. He's a teen by himself raising a daughter I think that they would be pretty okay with having him kind of you know be part of the family basically uh she's really really tired I wanted to look really quickly so there's nothing going on this day but Saturday there's supposed to be a neighborhood brawl like what <laughs> That's really, really strange, but we need to do, we need to add a couple of things in here, which I wanted to do, let's see, maybe Sunday, okay, it's summertime, let me see, let's add holiday, I wanted to add like the 4th of July, so we're gonna add the 4th, and we're going to do, let's see, um, decoration, we'll do like spring, I guess, uh, and we could do... What should we do? We could do some barbecuing. Um, we'll decorate. We will do... Uh, let's see here. Is there anything about like shooting off fireworks or anything? Smoking weed. Are you, are you freaking kidding me? Okay. Uh, there's nothing about like fireworks? Unless I'm missing that somewhere. Oh, right here. Okay, duh. Uh, so we'll do some fireworks. Um, and is that all we should do? Slow down, appreciate objects, art and music, uh, baking, flowers, 
we could do a grand meal. I mean, probably not. Um, party spirit. I guess we could do like party spirit. There we go. We'll just do those few things for the 4th of July, which will be on Sunday. So we're going to go ahead and make that a little holiday because I really wanted to do that. So that will be on Sunday. So I don't think this part has been too, too long. I need to actually see how long I've been filming, but I really kind of can't tell, but I think it's been long enough. So what I'm going to do is go ahead and wrap up this part right here. I hope that you guys enjoyed it. Let me know what you guys think about moving him and Belle in and kind of taking them in as part of the family to make sure, you know, their well-being is, you know, they're safe and everything because he, like I said, is a teen on his own raising a daughter. He's living by himself. I think that Veronica and Liam would definitely want them to move in. Let's see. We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I think that we could have the two of them move in. I think that would be like a full household, but we'll have to see. We'll have to see how it goes. Let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Leave a like on this video if you guys are enjoying it. Subscribe before you go if you have not already. Also, turn on your post notifications so you can be notified when I upload, which is usually every single day except for Sunday. And as usual, I love you all so very much, and I'll see you guys very, very soon. Bye, guys.